Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the awardees for the 12th High School Recognition Rites, the candidates for the 4th Moving Up Ceremony, and the candidates for the 3rd Senior High School Graduation for school year 2019-2020. The Aguinaldo International School High School Faculty and Staff. The Aguinaldo International School Administrators. Ladies and gentlemen, the Philippine National Anthem.
all the pain that life may bring. There's no other hope that I can lean upon. Lead me, Lord. Lead me all my life. Walk by me. Walk by me across the lonely roads that I may face. Take my arms and let your hand show me the way. Show the way to live inside your heart. All my days, all my life, you are my. Open the ceremony, please welcome Lara Marie Beatriz Marasigan of Grade 10 Michael Faraday for the welcome address. School administrators, faculty members, parents, fellow students, ladies and gentlemen, good morning and welcome to the virtual moving up ceremony of class 2020. Today, my fellow students and I are very excited to begin a new chapter in our lives and pursue what the future holds for us. Many of us will surely miss the years we've spent here together at Aguinaldo International School. And yes, we have conquered another important milestone, not only for ourselves, but also for our dear parents who have been working tirelessly all these years to give us the most meaningful education we could ever have in our lifetime. So to our beloved parents, thank you for all your support and congratulations as well. You did it too. Today, for some of us, we also say goodbye to Aguinaldo International School to pursue more specialized academic disciplines elsewhere. But we will never forget the never-ending lessons we have learned from this school, like how to be more responsible, to express the best versions of ourselves, 
to be mindful of the needs of others, and many more. Also, here in our school, we were surrounded by our teachers who helped us be more responsible and at the same time be better prepared for the future ahead of us. I am sure they all want us to succeed in all our dreams. So to our beloved teachers, thank you for guiding us all and for believing in each and every one of us, especially during those times that we doubted ourselves. To be perfectly honest, I am both excited and at the same time worried about moving up in the light of the pandemic COVID-19 and its lack of vaccine and possible cure anytime soon. We haven't started our grade 11 and yet we are faced with the challenge to fight and end COVID-19. Our moving up is the best time for us to show our communities what we are capable of helping to end this pandemic. Let's apply what we've learned in school about sacrifice, caring, and looking after one another. As students, let's be more responsible now than ever. Soon, we may have to attend on-campus classes and enjoy our lunch breaks in cafeteria while observing physical distancing. We may have to wear masks regularly to protect ourselves and classmates from becoming sick. Or, we may have to attend online classes at the comforts of our homes and just virtually say our highs and hellos to our teachers and friends, just like in our moving up ceremony today. I know these restrictions are kind of frustrating, but let's not forget that we are all in this together and all our sacrifices today will surely be remembered as a moment in our history that we did something far greater than ourselves and that is to protect our community. I would like to conclude by expressing my personal thanks to my classmates at grade 10 Faraday and to my friends here in Aguinaldo International School and most of all to my teachers. I couldn't have done it without you and thank you for making my stay here in school very memorable. Again, thank you to my family for their never-ending support, especially to my mom, my dad, my sister Lauren, my lolos and lolas, my aunts and uncles, and my cousins. And lastly, I'd like to thank the Lord Almighty for bringing us all together virtually today to still witness and enjoy this momentous event despite the pandemic. Class of 2020, I hope that we will all be an inspiration for the younger students and the succeeding generations witnessing this event. Always remember, you all have a special place in my heart and I will never forget all the wonderful memories we had here at Aguinaldo International School. So class of 2020, stay safe, stay healthy, congratulations, and good luck. To give us his message, please welcome our beloved school president, Dr. Jose Paulo E. Campos. Our hardworking principal, Ms. Julie Pello, our dear students, who today are moving on to the next stage of their educational preparation. Our valued parents, our partners in the education of our students, dedicated teachers and administrators who devote their talents and time to prepare our students to attain their aspirations and make a difference in this world. We celebrate all of you today but most especially our students, in recognition of the hard work they have put to reach this point in their personal development. It is a celebration unlike all other moving on celebrations in the past. Instead of the social event of being physically in one venue, we are now virtually celebrating this important milestone not just in the lives of our students, but also in the lives of our parents and teachers here at Aguinaldo International School. As I prepared this message, I tried to imagine how the final composition may turn out when all of the messages, photos and videos are blended into a seamless composition how may it compare to the traditional live event? 
I have seen similar productions in short performances by chorales and ballet, where members delivered performances individually in their homes and later blended to a seamless composition. I have even watched Facebook Live performance of the Midsummer Night's Dream by the Shakespeare Company led by no less than our former drama director, Nick Campos. And I have been impressed by how the creative directors, the performers, and the media technology practitioners have successfully overcome the gulf of remoteness and the limitations of a two-dimensional media to treat the audience to an impressive performance. I am hoping that this production will do no less. In fact, this event may just be a preview of what our students will have to face in the future. With climate change, human divisions and conflict, an expanding human population, and resource com constraints to name a few, this experience today may just be a foretaste of what our students will have to manage in the coming decades. Our students will need to be prepared to accelerate their learning in all fields of knowledge to successfully meet those challenges of the future. Fortunately, the human mind is a limitless resource and learns and imagines infinite solutions to meet ever complicated situations. Our current pandemic has become the impetus for the accelerated development of vaccines and therapies heretofore unheard of in both approach and speed of development until today. There are over 120 companies in a worldwide race to develop the vaccine for COVID-19 as the novel coronavirus is referred to. Many are using either a recombinant DNA vaccine where the DNA of a benign virus, such as the virus of a common cold, is edited to include the spike of the coronavirus to teach the human immune system to immediately recognize a COVID infection when one does occur. The other new vaccine uses a messenger RNA to direct the vaccinated cells to express themselves into a protein just like the COVID spike so the immune system will immediately recognize an infection. While there are still many unanswered questions that will require time for human trials, never in human history has vaccine development proceeded at such a speed. I hope you're all taking some interest in learning about this virus and the human condition in this most unusual time. You are all in a vast laboratory where new and unknown worlds have presented themselves and await some of you, like the explorers of the past, to bring into human understanding for the improvement of life. I hope you will all adjust to the new world of remote learning. Time is all we have and to delay your education for one year during the early years of your development will later result in a profound difference in your future. You should practice self-discipline and keep focused on your education and your progress towards your life's dreams. I wish to thank our parents for trusting Aguinaldo International School with the education of all our students. We shall continue to adapt to provide the best educational value for all our students. Have a great summer, congratulations, and keep safe. To give us her message, please welcome our beloved school principal, Ms. Julie B. Pello. 
To Aguinaldo International School families and friends, parents and guardians, teachers and staff, awardees and graduates, a pleasant day. As a class of 2020, you have made your mark on your school. You will remember this day, these teachers and all of us gathered here virtually to mark another important passage of time. Congratulations on your outstanding achievements. We celebrate your achievements amidst challenging times. To our 2020 graduates and awardees, I am enormously proud of you. Each one of you has worked hard to realize your full potential. You have grown so much and worked towards achieving your goals in a very determined way. To all of your parents, I would like to take this opportunity to thank you for your tremendous support and willingness to support your child's education in AIS. We value and acknowledge the support of the parent community in the provision of an inclusive education. To our teachers and staffs, I feel very proud of you for being instrumental in ensuring that learners' needs for relatedness, competency, and autonomy are met. Your dedication to educating our students is enormous. You have nurtured a love of learning and a resilience that is essential to great accomplishment. To our students, as B.B. King says, the beautiful thing about learning is that no one can take it away from you. Never stop trying, never stop learning, give nothing but your best, set goals, manage time, self-reflect, and overcome setbacks for your next journey. Again, I congratulate you on your accomplishment. The non-academic awards are given to students who participated and won in various non-academic events and competitions within the school for the school year 2019-2020. The awardees are
Aguinaldo International School is a values-oriented international school that produces academically excellent and globally competent students. For 12 years, it advocates the three core values of virtue, excellence, and service. Today, we recognize the students of the high school department who have shown exemplary performances and achievements in academics, co-curricular affairs, and leadership for school year 2019-2020. Ladies and gentlemen, the awardees from the undergraduate classes of the junior and senior high school who manifested outstanding academic excellence. The awardees from grade 7 Euclid, Ablen the Saint Parish with high honors. Alvarez James Patrick with honors. Baxa Andre Joshua with honors. Tapatingan Renee Sofia with high honors. Suse Gabriel Jose with honors. Ventura Joshua Andre with high honors. The awardees from Grade 8 Martin Luther King, Abrea Aria with honors. Dionio Valerie with honors. Estrella Patrick Neil Seth with honors. Kondo Royal with honors. Maktal Chastin with honors. Maglalang Leona Angela with high honors. Revilla Me Elijah Marie with high honors. Sia Hazel Angela with honors. Tendido Gloriel Teresa with high honors. Zervolakos Justin with honors. Zorita Brentville with honors. The awards from Grade 9 John Dewey. Baxa Roger Joseph with high honors. Kabatingan Maika Marie with high honors. Chua Elijah Jerry with honors. Australia Chantal Angel with high honors. Gardose Sofia Alexander with honors. Henry Raven Math with honors. Margarejo Cassandra Grace with high honors. Martinez Iana May with honors. Resco Angeline with high honors. Reynoso Linel with high honors. Robles Royce Shan with high honors. The awardee from grade 11 Francis Fitzgerald. Ready Pretty with high honors.
This special academic award is given to students who demonstrated a very satisfactory overall academic performance as indicated in his or her final general average but was under a given learning support program at a certain quarter in the school year. The special academic awardees are Nguyen Kien Duk Kim Yong Jun Norberta Lorenzo Aginawa International School recognizes its homegrown students who entrusted their holistic development under the care of the institution. The school recognizes their journeys in AIS by presenting to them the distinction of being loyalty awards. The loyalty awards are Zurita Granvit. Sing Love Brick The Leadership Award is given to students who embodied desirable characteristics of a true leader. A leader who guides others toward a common goal, shows the way by example, and creates an environment wherein other team members feel actively involved in the entire process. This year's recipients of the Aguinaldo International School Leadership Award are Ramos Aaron Vincent So Yun Lee The outstanding performances in a specific discipline is given to students who have shown commendable academic performances in particular learning areas. De La Cruz Nebron Ailrich, Outstanding Performance in Mathematics, Social Studies, Music, and ICT. Kim Chan, Outstanding Performance in English and Athletics. Marcelo Ross Michael, Outstanding Performance in Arts. So J. Song, Outstanding Performance in Science, English, Mathematics, ICT, and Athletics. Stuart Russell Cock, Outstanding Performance in Athletics. Swatenko Theodore Lewis, Outstanding Performance in English, Social Studies, ICT, and Basic Research. Valenzuela Elvinario de Sica, Outstanding Performance in Music and Athletics. Zurita Grande, Outstanding Performance in Social Studies and Athletics. Ross Carril and Outstanding Performance in English, Music, Home Economics. Marasigan Lara Marie Beatriz, Outstanding Performance in Science, English, Mathematics, Social Studies, Arts, ICT, Basic Research and Home Economics. Ramos Aaron Vincent. Outstanding Performance in Work Immersion and Athletics. Sing Love Creek. Outstanding Performance in Work Immersion. Salvalosa Alex Sayak. Outstanding Performance in Athletics. So Yun Lee. Outstanding Performance in Research, Arts, Communication Arts English. Work Immersion, Science, and Mathematics. The Special Academic Award is given to students who demonstrated a very satisfactory overall academic performance as indicated in his or her final general average.
but was under a given learning support program at a certain partner in the school year. The special academic awardee among the grade 10 students is So J. Thong. The special academic awardee from the grade 12 students is So Yun Li. The Academic Excellence Awards are conferred upon students in acknowledgement of their excellent academic achievements. With highest honors is given to a student with a general average of 98 to 100 and with no final grade lower than 85 in all learning areas. With high honors is awarded to a student with a general average of 95 to 97 and with no final grade lower than 85 in all learning areas. With honors is bestowed upon students with a general average of 90 to 94 and with no final grade lower than 85 in all learning areas. The Academic Excellence Awardees with honors among the grade 10 students are De La Cruz Nibron Ailrich. Kim Chan Suatenko Theodore Luis Valenzuela El Binario de Sen Zurita Grande Ross Caril and Ip Moira Isabel The Academic Excellence Awardees with high honors among the grade 10 students is Lara Marie Beatriz Marasi. The Academic Achievement Award with honors among the grade 12 students is Salvalosa Alex Saib. Good afternoon, Ms. Julie B. Pelo. I have the honor to present to you the candidates for the Junior High School Moving Up of Aguinaldo International School this school year 2019-2020 composed of nine boys and four girls with a total of 14 completers they have satisfactorily fulfilled all the requirements as a junior high school completers and they are commendable to receive their certificates by the authority vested in me as the representative of Ms. Lenore Embryones Secretary of Department of Education and having been presented by the high school head teacher, I now confirm you junior high school completers of Aguinaldo International School this school year 2019-2020. Congratulations! And for the grade 12 graduates, Ms. Julie B. Pelo, I have the honor to present to you the candidates for the senior high school graduation of Aguinaldo International School this school year 2019-2020, composed of four boys and two girls with a total of six graduates. They have satisfactorily fulfilled all the requirements as senior high school graduates and they are commendable to receive their certificates. By the authority vested in me as the representative of Ms. Lenore M. Briones, Secretary of Department of Education, and having been presented by the high school head teacher, I now confirm you senior high school graduates of Aguinaldo International School this school year 2019-2020. Congratulations! Good day! It is my honor to present to you the Junior High School Completers from Grade 10, Michael Faraday. Nevron El Raj de la Cruz with honors. K. 
Kim Chai with honors. Ross Michael Marcelo. So Jason Special Academic Award. Russell Clark Stewart. Theodore Luis Wathenko with honors. Ahmed Tayan. Elvinario Valenzuela II with honors. Dranville Zorita with honors. Kaila Alo. Karil Ann Frost with honors. Moira Isabel Ip with honors. Lara Marie Beatriz Marasigan with high honors. Congratulations, grade 10 computers. Good day. It is now my honor to present to you the senior high school graduates from grade 12 Rizal. Aaron Vincent Ramos. Lovebrit Singh. Abdurrao Tayari. In the Remar Treat Tour. Alex Saira Salvalosa with honors. So Yun Lee Special Academic Award. Congratulations. To speak a message of gratitude on behalf of her fellow completers and graduates, please welcome So Yun Lee of Grade 12 of Jose Rizal. A very good morning to every one of you. Most especially to our principal, my dear teachers, and my batchmates. To my friends, family, and teachers that helped me get to where I am today. I'm Unli So from Grade 12, Rizal. It's an honor to deliver a speech on such a memorable occasion. First of all, I would like to thank AIS for providing us with good education and various learning opportunities. Thank you to the principal for giving us the best environment for our overall development. And all the teachers for being such wonderful mentors and guides. I would especially like to thank our class advisor, Mom Josh, for her constant support towards us. She always answered my questions and helped me very kind-heartedly. Furthermore, I would like to congratulate all of the students here, including myself, for finally graduating. Thank you to all of my classmates for their love and friendship. I believe every one of us in grade 12 will keep doing our best whenever we go. It has been an amazing journey in AIS, which I would most likely never forget. Every little encounters and experiences gained here in AIS has been enriching and will remain within my memories for as long as I'm alive. I feel sad because an important chapter of our lives is coming to an end. 
However, I feel elated at the same time, since there is a whole new chapter of life awaiting us. We have entered an age for celebration, an era to memorialize who we were, who we are, and who we will eventually become. Celebrate this milestone greater than all the others, for it's the time we have spent here in our high school careers that will always be held close to our hearts. The grade 12 has seven students from five different countries around the world. Yet we met in AIS and grew together. Our times here can all be considered a learning experience, during which we discovered the value of friendship and the importance of individualism, discipline, and responsibility. We gained new responsibilities and had to step it up in school. We started carving our careers. I'm sure that the values, ethics, character, the academic, and other basic skills we have learned at our school will really help us in shaping our bright future. I'm hopeful we will bring glory and laurels to the school with our achievements as we are the brand ambassadors of our school. We have made so many memories, but finally we have come here to bid each other farewell. In the end, I would like to thank everyone once again. I will definitely miss you all. I wish you all the very best and I wish you all a very successful life ahead. Thank you. To lead the completers and graduates in professing their oath of loyalty to the institution, please welcome Dranville F. Zurita of Grade 10 Michael Faraday. To my fellow completers and graduates, please raise your right hand and let us all recite the oath of loyalty. I, state your name, Gender Zurita, pledge to the best of my ability to be a committed alumnus of Aguinaldo International School in the context of service and amity to others. To demonstrate endless support to my institution by promoting the core values of virtue, excellence, and service. To witness in my daily life the qualities which depict personal well-being, leadership, social, and life skills. So help me God. Administrators, faculty, and staff of the Aguinaldo International School would like to express their gratitude to all who have made this school year a very successful and meaningful one. Thank you. Viciousness and causes of success May you have the confidence to always do your best May you take no effort in your being generous Sharing what you can, nothing more, nothing less May you know the meaning of the word happiness May you always lead from the beating in your chest May you be treated like an esteemed guest May you get to rest, may you catch your breath or May the best of your todays be the worst of your tomorrows Whoa! Or may the road less paved be the road that you follow oh. Well, here's to the hearts that you gon' break Here's to the lives that you gon' change Here's to the infinite possible ways to love you I want you to have it Here's to the good times we gonna have You don't need money, you got a free pass Here's to the fact that I'll be sad without you you to have it all Slap bracelet, may 
May you keep the chaos and the clutter off your desk May you have unquestionable health and less stress Having no possessions, no immeasurable wealth May you get a gold star on your next test May your educated guesses always be correct And may you win prizes shining like diamonds May you really own it each moment to the next or May the best of your todays be the worst of your tomorrows Whoa. Or May the road less paved be the road that you follow well, here's to the hearts that you're gonna break Here's to the lives that you're gonna change Here's to the infinite possible ways to love you I want you to have it Here's to the good times we gonna have You don't need money, you got a free pass Here's to the fact that I'll be sad without you I want you to have it all can imagine, oh, no matter what your path is, if you believe it, then anything can happen. Go, 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 raise your glasses, go, 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 you can have it.